Happy Easter! Hope you're having a great day everybody. If you're watching this from any other time in the year, I hope you're having a great day too. Now Easter, much like all the other holidays, is all about overindulging of chocolate. And as a chocoholic myself, I'm a little bit guilty of this too. So let's make sure we burn some calories before we start eating. I'm Carl from TheMorrisMethod.com. Like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And let's jump straight into this workout. Okay, so for our first exercise, we are going to be going into a squat and knee drive. If you want to pump this up a little bit and do a little bit of jumping, we're going twist and squats. We've got 25 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. Let's go. So again, squat knee drive for those that don't want to jump. If you are jumping, you're going into a twist and down into that squat. So we have five different exercises, 10 seconds rest in between each exercise and we've got to do this four times over. We got it. Keep it up and push. Nice. Okay, we're going down to the floor into mountain climbers. Again, if you want to slow it down, just tap that foot in. Otherwise, keep that heart rate up. And let's jump into it. So we're driving those knees in. Keep your core nice and strong. Back stay straight. Shoulders right on top of your wrists. If you need to slow it down, just drive those knees in, that's good. And if you can keep up the push, keep up the speed, you've got it. Keep going. Nice work, okay. We're back onto our feet, we're going into side lunges, and we're going to alternate legs. Big step out, touching that floor, step in and across. Constantly deep breaths, control your breathing, don't let your breathing control you. If you do need to slow down or grab a drink at any time, go for it. Nice. Okay, and we're going back down to the floor again. We're going into push ups. Now, if you want to drop onto your knees, all good. Otherwise, Onto your toes, coming straight in and back. Nice. Elbows coming about 45 degrees into your body. If you are dropping to your knees, go for it. Make sure the chest comes down at the same time as your hips. We've got it. Keep going. Ooh. Okay, and the last workout last exercise of this workout is burpees. So hands down, jumping back, jump in, and stand up. If you want to slow things down, you're stepping back and stepping in. If you want to go even harder, you're jumping in, and we're jumping up. So you can choose how hard you want to make this. Work. Okay, that is exercise five. Grab a little drink if you need. It's all there. And going back to those twist squats. So we've only got a 10 seconds rest in between each one. If you need to slow it down again, knees up. Come on, keep it moving. Ooh. In and control. Well done. Down to the floor, mountain climbers. Are we ready? Let's go. Constantly putting in that work. Keep your abs nice and tight. Support your lower back. Shoulders on top of your wrists. Control the movement. Slow it down if you need to. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Damn. Okay, side lunges it is. We've got it. Let's go. And drop. You're only bending the leg that you're stepping out with. The other leg stays straight. Nice. 
Nice. Keep going, guys. We've got it. Almost done. Good work. Okay, push ups. Woo. You got it? You ready? Again, drop to your knees if you have to, making sure you're working through your core. Ooh. Well done. Last exercise, burpees. Deep breaths. Are you ready? Hands down, jumping back, and in. And you can just stand there, straightening out. Squeeze the glutes at the top. You don't want to start halfway. You want to make sure you're standing all the way up. Completely reset. Then go back in. Nice. That's round two done. We're halfway. We got to shake off those hands. We're going into those squats. Let's do it. Come on. Nice work, guys. It's all at your own pace, remember? If you need to pause this video, take a deep breath, have a bit more rest, go for it. Grab a drink if you need at any time. Nice. We're going back down to the floor, get those bouncing climbers in. We ready? Let's keep going. Think about what you're doing it for. The end result, the end goal. Always keep that in mind when you're exercising. Ooh, good as be doing it to feel good about yourself. Make yourself some good. Feel good to chop for it as I'm doing. Let's go, side lunges. Whatever your goal is, keep that in focus. Good work. We can do it. Deep breaths. Ooh, like me, I'm out of breath. We've got it. Nice work. Okay, push up. Ooh. The mat keeps moving. Let's go. Down to the floor. Okay. And in. Feel no shame about going down to your knees. Just taking off a little bit of your body weight to help you. It's always good to make sure you're keeping technique. So you need to take it easy a little bit by dropping down and making sure the back stays straight. That's perfect. Okay, last one of the round. Burpees. Woo. Keep going. Nice. Almost. Last one. Ooh. Three rounds down, last one coming up. Squats. Yeah, Daniel. Let's go. Come on. Put in that effort. Five exercises left. Keep moving. My hair's all over the place. I don't know where I'm going now. Ooh, damn. Nice. Last four, mountain climbers. Let's get our body down. Drive those knees in. 
Let's go. Come on, Carl. Get the back straight. Keep those knees pumping. Abs nice and tight. Okay, we're on to side lunges. Let's go. I never need a hairband, do I? <laughs> I've said that before, I still haven't got one. That's fine. It's not going to stop me doing this. Keep it going. Last few. Push-ups. Two more exercises. Ooh. Come on. The wonders of technology. Ooh. Let's go. We just filmed this last set of push-ups. Now I looked up and the camera was blank. So, don't feel ashamed if you drop down to your knees to keep the technique straight, making sure your back stays straight with the shoulders. We've got it. Nice. Yeah, just doing that. Looked up, camera's completely blank. That's fine. So a little skip. We're going to burpees. Last one. Let's go. Ooh. Don't know what happened, but we got it. Come on. Nice. Last two. Maybe three. One more. Come on. Oh. And that's a wrap. Ooh, well done everybody. We have definitely earned that little treat. Now it's time to relax, take your breath, have some water, and just let that heart rate come back to normal now. Now with that, probably you would have burnt about 100 to 150 calories in that short period. But the good thing about resistance training and HIIT work is that your metabolism is now higher than it was before. For the next 24 hours, you'll be burning more calories than you did yesterday without this workout. So I hope that helps. Guys, if you like the video, drop me a like below, comment on what you like most, and subscribe with the bells on so you never miss a future video. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.